You have plans to use a rideshare service to get where you need to go. Some users say you might have trouble booking a ride. As KTV News Watch 7's Abby Peterson reports, many rideshare drivers are choosing to stay parked as gas prices climb. Rideshare drivers say the increase in cost in gas is taking a toll on business. Slowly becoming a larger and larger impact on drivers, especially on our profitability. Um, we don't have the ability to negotiate our pricing with our customers. Andrew Nakuda has been driving for Uber and Lyft for four years. He says starting today, Uber and Lyft are giving them a fuel surcharge. Uber drivers will get 45 cents for rides and 35 cents for food delivery. But drivers say it's not enough to cushion the blow. I'm challenged because I drive a, a full-size pickup truck, so I have to be really careful. Jeff Taylor has also been driving for Uber for four years. Like other drivers, he says he's being more selective on where and when he gives rides. We're getting these requests to drive 20, 25 minutes to pick somebody up and take them on a three minute trip. Well, you can't do that. You, you, I mean, we, we got to make a buck. Taylor says these prices are so high, it might make him lock the doors for good. Now customers say they're struggling to find a ride. Juliet Rios and Quay Johnson are in town for the Billie Eilish concert. When I was here earlier, I probably seen like one or two, but as of like right now, I haven't really seen it and I've been here like for like two or three days. The drivers say they're doing the best they can. They add if you call for a ride, you should be ready on time. Be patient. Remember, if you enjoyed your ride, even if you leave a dollar, it's better than nothing. Reporting in Omaha, Abby Peterson, KETV News Watch 7.